So I think a very good afternoon to all. And uh, the brightest mind, I'm addressing some of the brightest mind. First of all, thank you. Thank you for giving this opportunity to share whatever experience, whatever less experience I have to share with uh, the future of our country, the brightest mind. I'm honored to share the dais with some of the dignitaries and honorable minister. That's a great, great pleasure for me and an honor. So I think uh, I would start when we say startups. You know, startups comes with a lot of courage. So as uh, first thing I would say, you are having a great privilege, you know, all the students here, the startups here, who have that opportunity to kind of leverage this kind of a platform. First of all, you have a great, great platform, great privilege. And for startups, uh, there are certain things. First, this currently in India, the era is of design. And I strongly believe that, and I think many of you will concurrent on that. We have been manufacturing since ages, but this is the time when we design. Design in India for global, no more jugad. So I uh, request, I insist, I even profess that no more jugad, we build for the world. So as a, thank you. So this is an era of design, design in India for the global. So as a startup, as a founder, when you decide, first thing you need are courage, right? And you have all it, right? Because you're sitting here means you have taken the first step. Second is problem, you need to solve a problem. It shouldn't be a temporary problem, it shouldn't be a very local problem. It has to be a problem which is at masses and which is not temporary. And you should have a unique solution to it which is very, very important. Anything which has worked in US doesn't mean that it will work in India. So please get to the ground. Get to the ground and try to solve the problem. And last, but it is very, very important, the road to profitability, which I think very much uh, is being talked now that what is the road to making money, making a, a sustainable business, right? So right when you're starting your journey now, these are very, very important points to be kept in mind. And a little bit of gyan on, you know, innovation is very important. But I would say innovation at the cost of business is brutal. So that is where I would like to address the second, uh, you know, stakeholders, those who are in this uh, room, the education institution, a government, and other organizations, I think we have to kind of give that platform, which already the inis uh, initiative has started, because hardware startups or hardware ideas are hard. It takes time, it takes money, there is a gestation period. So we need that kind of conducive environment. First of all, we need awareness. I think there are a lot of government policies, support, but somewhere we as startup don't know because we are busy building something. So we need awareness, we need that support. And we need, this is a request to the government that we need uh, much, much simpler processes, more efficient uh, you know, gatekeepers at the other side because we, as startups, we have very less bandwidth, right? We are busy solving something. So that is a support I would uh, request on behalf of all the startups that we need easy processes. We need a lot of awareness about so much of support that government is giving. And institution, educational institutions, I think uh, I, in the morning also we had a conversation that, you know, the professors, the R&Ds, the PhDs have to now think that beyond just R&D projects, a sustainable business. Is this R&D solving a problem? Is this a sustainable or enough big problem it is that it has a market? So I think we have to just step up because we have been doing that, but somewhere we are lacking that design. I still, that is where I think I took, uh, you know, the courage twice. My first business was into R&D services. And everyone thought, what is, you know, this lady doing? And then I built it up and I could uh, build that very well successfully. And then got into more crazy idea of building, getting into automotive, which is like 
वर्ल्ड सेकेंड कॉम्प्लेक्स बिजनेस और करने से होता है सो गाइज इफ यू ट्राई इफ यू डू इट हैपन्स and there is ample opportunity and you sitting in iit you can't say you don't have opportunity we all have that brilliant platform where we can you know reach out to the entire community and reach out for help so i would leave with that thought right now it is the area era of design in india made in india for the global so thank you thank you so much जदि आपन को आम भिडी भल लगला तेब चेल को लाइक शेयर और सब्सक्राइब करने को जमा भी बुलां नहीं